Yo guys, it's Auto Chain. Welcome back to another video. In today's video, I'm gonna be showing you how to do mismatch wheels along with wheel swaps and like some tips with the uh, calipers. But uh, yeah, let's get right into the video. All right, so you wanna just go ahead and get your car. Um, normally, your car would just come with the uh, the front left right here and the other nodes. So. And then now you want to go ahead and get your wheels. I already have my wheels in here. You want to go ahead and find a way how, you know, you're going to get uh, the wheels that you want to use. And for right now, these are the wheels that I am going to be using. So you want to go ahead. Well, I like to do just to keep it simpler. Um, go ahead and get the wheel. Go ahead and get these. And just unlink them. And then also that, sorry for my background noise. Uh, <laughs> I live across on a busy street and I do have my windows open, but if I had them closed, you'd still hear it. So, yeah. <laughs> gotta be loud especially in Miami all right so we go ahead just hide that body I want to go ahead so what I like to do go in collision up there that will let you see all your collisions that's what you're gonna need and want to go ahead and make sure your original your the wheels that you're putting in make sure the they're centered so you just want to get this tool and then make sure keep object is on you gotta make sure those are centered and which of those are go ahead go to the like the hand looking tool right there uh then you want to go ahead and try to click on it turn off keep object uh with that let's see let me just go ahead and take out these collisions in it Unlink these just to make sure nothing on those mess up. And then, so these are going to be your left fronts. Go to find your left fronts. So you got both of those in the center of it, which, whoa, why does that look like that? <laughs> Maybe you in the center. Good, get this. No, okay. Make sure that's all. Good, right. get this. Get your collision. Put that on it. Make sure that's. Alright, cool. That's on there. Then your left, right. side because you're going to be basically mirroring these collisions to the other side I'm going to go ahead and check um, how it is it's going to look like that because you have collisions uh, off again so for you um, you want to go ahead and adjust your wheel and stuff uh, so 
how to play with rake basically i'd say you're either gonna have to move your friend or veer uh wheel up and down and to make your rake even you're gonna make sure both of these uh both of these are even with the car's body how like some cars as you see like they're tilted uh like slightly gonna have to just play with it and see if you can you know get the rake even but let me go ahead and just mess with the mess with the sizing that I want of the fronts. Alright, so at this point, you're gonna uh, want to remember these numbers so you could get it exactly even on the other side, so you could put a negative in front of it. Same thing for this one.
and then go ahead and duplicate, duplicate your uh, collisions. Okay, before you put them in, you want to go ahead and uh, position your collisions. Alright, so basically to do mismatch, you want to go ahead and get your flags ready. So basically do that, you want to go ahead and go to collisions, make sure that's turned on, then isolate your collision. Then scroll down here in the properties tab, so use the defined options. And then, so basically, uh, left front and your right rear is going to be AE. And your uh, left rear and right front are going to be A. So we want to go ahead and come over here, type in flag add your left front that's gonna be AE right rear AE make sure you press apply or else it won't you know work uh, I think I'm gonna go ahead and do that to your left rear right front these these ones are gonna be a uh, Alright, so once you got your flag set, you want to go ahead and just uh, place them back in the car. Go ahead, look. And then you want to obviously go ahead and uh, get your brakes and all that lined up. And then uh, for your calipers, to actually get them moving with the wheel, what you're going to do is make sure you have uh keep object on and then go to like your wheel and then go do this and let's see your left front and then you have right here you would do that and it would take the position of your wheel and make sure it uh swings with your wheel but i'm gonna do go ahead and do this off camera and i'll be back Alright, so now once you have everything how you want it to be placed, our collisions uh, placed properly um, and everything is looking good how you want it, you can now export it. Alright, so we go ahead and load it up in game and this is how it turned out. Um, as you see, you know, when you do your brakes, uh, your calibers correctly, they don't uh, spaz out and stuff. And, uh, yeah, everything's, everything's good. There's nothing wrong with the wheel. And we have uh, two different wheels. And that's pretty much how I do mismatch. It's, uh, it's, it's pretty simple. It's not too hard. And yeah, that's the video.